Recording has started. Hi everyone. Uh, this is a demo for like extension work on AI Siri CI. Uh, we wanted to provide a feature where users can build their users can build their put it up. Think it's good enough. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. So users, uh, this is an extension work for allowing users to build their package based on uh, different environments. And so, if they want to package uh, the application for suppose for separately for UBI aid based image or Fedora based image, they can do it from a single point. Uh, they can define everything in their own in the single repository and based on based on overlays and. Uh, here we're using the uh, concept of customize and or the feature of OLAs, and then we, we will try to build uh, through that. Uh, this is also um, this all uh, also corresponds to the previous demo, uh, which Fido has demonstrated. It's about uh, showing how Solver uses um, S2I dot based images uh, and how they are built through uh, through source to uh, from. Initially, we used to use Docker file based uh, strategy, but now we are uh, moved to the source to image strategy, and we are also using this feature of overlays and building through it. Uh, so, if uh, so, this is a repository of solvers. I'm trying to show the demo on my fork. So, uh, so we have this OLA directory where we have to find each and every uh, environment which for which we want to build solvers for uh, the uh, for example. In one of the OLAs, right? There would be the package uh, Python packages dependency files, pipen pip uh, and the there would be similar in others as well for each and every um, environment based on that. So, and what two important things which we require to build this from AI CI is first is dot yaml dot configuration file. This will contain the information about the overlays uh, and, and the environment. Uh, this was this is uh, like more detailed explanation is given in uh, in another demo by by Fredo. Uh, please have a look at it. Uh, but here, there uh, we can define that the OLA directory is named as OLAs runtime environments. Which all runtime environments do we wanna uh, have for this particular repository? So we are defining based on their uh, so this would be the OLA name. We are providing which base image to be used to build this particular o OLA uh, with, and similarly, and some other details. So for a, for each and every environment we want to build the solver for, we have defined that in this .yaml file. Apart from this, the next important configuration file is the AICVCI YAML file. This is uh, still a work in progress. We want to change shift uh, the focus uh, in a slightly easier manner. But for now, what we have done is we have provided users to have this uh, feature via this particular check called overlays build. So users can put this check overlays build in their check uh, inside the ASC configuration YAML. And based on this, the the application will know the ACI application will know that it's a OLA based build strategy to be used here. So uh, the general flow of release is uh, we used to do is to open a release and based on that we get a tag and based on the tag we create the builds right. So here also we are doing the same thing. Uh, I've just created uh, this version 1.64. Uh, just pre done that so that this demo is a bit quicker. So it's just a get push to this and uh, a tag has been created for the solver. I'll take you to the back end side of it, like how pipelines are working on it. So uh, first a tag release pipeline, like as we all know, like a tag release pipeline starts first. It uh, if, if this is not an OLA based build, then it will build the image and push it to Quay uh, and do those sorts of operations. But here, because we are trying to build based on an OLA, this becomes uh, this particular pipeline becomes a controller, and it's saying that uh, for this tag uh, from this repository, let's create OLA pipelines. So uh, it first it signifies some details like which pipeline to be used, and then it creates that pipeline, and then it starts the pipeline. 
for each overlay uh, for each overlay uh, it has created a single sort of pi pipelines so uh, uh, for here for example here this pipeline will start its tag build as well it has created it and based on the def, uh, def uh, or definitions which were defined in the dot yaml file and the asu yaml file it uh, it extracted those things and it built based on them and then pushed it to Quay. Uh, from Quay, uh, we have defined all these things, so it's present in Quay, and then this could be used, uh, and then we can use this pipeline itself to deploy it to both applications and use the GitOps manner of using Argo CD to deploy it to our, our stage or test environments. Uh, the, if you were wondering why the others have failed, that's the only, the only reason why they have failed is because I haven't created Solver repositories in my uh, Quay in my Quay or an org. Just I just wanted to demo it for one, so that's why I have not created others. So that's why others have failed. But it's pretty much the same. If you can see, I've just recently tagged it, so it's it built and it pushed a uh, uh, a version, the latest version, and then that uh, and that's about it. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Nope. Looks good. Um, I, I, I think I asked that before. Is, um, there's, is there some kind of um, control flow breakage in there? Because um, you said there's one pipeline which is creating many other pipelines. That is mm -hmm. really walking them into the background and they are just running in the background, right? Yes. It's just okay. invoking. It is, uh, it is just uh, trying to like they are preset, but they are dynamic. Uh, in this particular pipeline, it's just dynamically setting that, okay, these are the uh, pipelines which needs to be started, and that's why it is taking, like, it will take that. Yeah. But, yeah. And do, do any of these uh, background pipelines feedback information into GitHub? Uh, yes, these all, uh, uh, sorry, if the question is if this pipeline or the created, the the overlay pipeline the created the yes. solver overlay pipeline yes so this solver overlay pipeline we haven't added the task yet uh, just because I wanted to do it quick but here would be another task which will send out the information to the uh, github saying that okay. particular file has been updated uh, like and like particular file means image tree we want to do that and like i said this will send out a pull request to uh, the manifest file saying this has been updated and inform Argo CD to deploy or resync it. Okay. Okay. Cool. Uh, if no other questions, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to open issue in ASUV or ask us at dot applications about it. Cool. Thank you. Uh, thanks, Ashad. Thanks.